Hey, I'm Sarah. I'm Natalie. And this is Natalie and Tara Try Stuff, a show in which you try stuff for the first time. And today we're making popsicles. Yeah, yeah. The fast way. We got sent this quick pop maker from Zoku to try out, and I'm really excited about this one. Mm. We're gonna make some breakfast pops. A little bit of yogurt, a little bit of fruit, a little bit of granola. It sounds like magic. Yeah, this is a recipe we found off of their blog. They also have some uh, recipe books. Uh, we don't have one of the recipe books, nope. but they're, uh, this one sounded yummy. It does. I'm excited. We can't do a traditional unboxing because I had to open this up and put the core, the popsicle maker, in the freezer 24 hours in advance so that it's ready to make those quick pops. But let's show you what's inside. Included besides that giant pop maker, which we'll show you in a second, um, we've got all of our popsicle sticks. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. These are, um, there's six, so you can make one set. Oh, Put some more in yeah. and make your other set. This is your tool for taking it out. It's a fancy, fancy tool. These are your drip guards. And then some fun the tools. There are all these things that you can make little cutouts. Yay. I don't know exactly. I mean, you pop Yay. these out of here and then use them mm -hmm. to make cutouts of fruit. Is yeah, that like there's little those little guys you make. So you 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 cut pop these out and you can like cut out apple pieces and other other fruits and stuff like that to make like little mm -hmm. little cats and and people and flowers and stuff. It's really fun. Super cute. What is that thing for? Oh, it's That's for leaning. That's on the side. Mm -hmm. The whole machine. Oh, we need that. Yeah, that. we need this. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, the first thing we have to do is we have to mix our vanilla yogurt with our milk. So it is uh, six ounces of vanilla Greek yogurt, half a cup of 2% milk. Mix this together until your milk and your yogurt become combined. Mixture will thin out and become a horrible consistency. Mm. Okay. Okay, I think that's done. I'm gonna put this in the fridge. Yes. I think that's wise. Um, while we do the next step so that it's at its coolest. We need to take raspberries. It's two to three per pop, but okay. we wanna cut them in half. Okay. Uh -huh. Whoop, I got it. You can use your special, special tool and you're gonna put these on there mm -hmm. and then stick them to the inside okay. wall of the Zoku maker. But the other way you can do it is with chopsticks. And I'm gonna try it with chopsticks. Here is the quick pot maker. It is freaking heavy. Here, hold that. It's just it's, a, it's a, it's a beast. It's well, a because beast. in here, yes, it is metal, but also there's liquid in there that's now frozen to ice, mm -hmm. which is how it works, it seems. I'm coming over here. All right. Okay. All right. I'm, I'm rolling over here. So you're gonna take that and you're gonna stick it to the inside. Oh, see, I think a two. I think we might have needed less than half. Those are big raspberries. Yeah, they're big raspberries. And so they do immediately like yeah, stick in there. Yeah, it immediately adheres. I think you can cut smaller pieces. Yeah, let's do that. Let's cut them down. There okay, we go. so will they stick to the side? I'm gonna try the the two, the chopstick. Try chopstick. That may be easier with these. Just drop it in there and push it where I want to go. Yeah, there you go. That works. It's much easier. But uh, not everybody's as handy dandy. I just smush it. That's mushy, true. That's true. We need to get our juices and we pour the juices in. Mm -hmm. Although I feel like these raspberries are gonna get in our way again. But we'll, we'll see what happens. We're gonna take this. We're gonna pour it into here. Okay. And then. So we're gonna pour halfway. halfway. Mm -hmm. Only halfway filled. Wait, oh my God, stop. What? We forgot to put the pops in there. Oh my God, the pops. The stick has gotta be in here, okay? Stick. Oh my goodness, that guys. That was almost a disaster was... again. Okay, okay, the sticks are in. Now you can pour about one ounce now. in each one. Here. You could just fill it all the way up, but we're doing something special here. We're doing fun things. Which is gonna be hard with those raspberries again. Yeah, raspberries are complicated. That's why I said I think the raspberries are gonna get our way again. So then, let's see. Let's allow the mixture to freeze. So we have to wait now. Oh, okay. For, for, for some time. Some time. I don't know how much pass. time, but we need it to wait until we can we can do the next magic layer. Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. let's say let's give it let's give it a five. Okay, sounds good. Okay. Open probably too full. Actually, they're all probably too full. Yeah. Because you got to put a layer of granola right, and then yeah, the thing. Yeah. Actually, you should put it in now and it'll start to sink a little bit. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Yum. I love granola. Might have overfilled here. Overdid, overdid. It's okay. So now there's a layer of granola in there. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to pour the rest of that mixture on okay. top of it. I'm going to do this little thing. I'm going to do a tappy tappy. And yeah, do the tappy tappy. There are simpler recipes. I mean, you can just pour pineapple juice in here. Yeah. 
but that's not how we that, do anything. That's not, no, that's not taking things to the next level. So chill pop should freeze in seven to nine minutes. So we did that first layer, uh -huh. but I think we go ahead and give this another, a, we'll give the top part of seven minutes, even though yeah. we already did that bottom yeah, part. Yeah, we might as well. Yeah. Okay, so seven minutes from now, we'll try to get these bad boys out of here. Sweet. Okay. All right. See you in seven. Mm-hmm. Okay, fingers crossed. So we have a little bit of a disclosure to say. We did try this once already, not this, not, the, uh, a couple weeks ago, and it didn't work for us, but we had gone rogue and tried this Nutella Pops thing that would have been amazing, but it uh -huh. wasn't one of their recipes. So we're trying again, but I'm now scared that we went rogue again, because uh -huh, uh -huh. even though we're doing one of the things, I don't know if this was an easiest one to try to. Yeah, we talked to the mechanics and we're like, oh, it could go wrong because of this okay. and that and this. So. So it's been seven minutes on even just that top layer. We'd already done the bottom. I guess I can kind of test to see how. So we can see that that's still a little not frozen Let's yet. Let's give it a minute. Let's give it another, so it's seven to nine. So we're gonna give it another two. Okay, another two. Another two. Go. Okay, the next thing you do is you take this handy dandy tool. It's called the screw super tool. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna put it on the top of here. Okay. And we're gonna screw it in. And then we're gonna pull it out. <sighs> so scared. Please work. Please work. Please work. <laughs> Pull. I'm gonna get hit in the face. Oh, oh wait, hold on. What? Continue to screw until it loosens. You're not supposed to. So that did that loosen. Oh. That went oh. oh! Oh my god! Oh. oh! Oh, I get it! It pushes something. It does something. Yeah, it's doing the work. Oh. Okay. So now you unscrew it, which I don't know how I okay. unscrew okay. it. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I'm still well, I'm still in here. Okay. I unscrew. Oh my god, that's amazing. Okay, wait, okay. we'll do film it again. Film so the second one. Film yeah, the second we'll do one. it again. We'll do it again. So you do okay. this, you okay. screw. You keep screwing, it gets tight, push, and it's going to do the work for you right there. There it is, Bam. through. okay. Aha! Whoa! Oh my goodness, but I'm not supposed to pull that all the way up. So then you put these guards Whoa. on. Which way do the guards go? That goes down like, oh, there pops go. on. Okay, okay. That goes down. That's amazing. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad that worked. Okay, so now yes. you have a breakfast popsicle. Yes. Yogurt, fruit, Amazing. Granola. Okay. So now we get to try them? Yes, we get to try them. <laughs> it's a solid popsicle. It's not like, I mean, that's solid. That's solid. solid. Yeah. I oh, can't. that's good too. You can't bite into it. Mm -mm. Super oh cool. Oh my gosh, okay. I wanna do this again. Okay. I would do this recipe again, mm -hmm. but I would chop up these much smaller. Mm -hmm. I would still use the tool. Yes. And put a lot of little ones all over mm -hmm. the thing. And then I would fill much less. Yeah. So just right Put there. a little bit of granola in yeah. there. Mm -hmm. And yes. then, and maybe even like, maybe I would do, I fill it a little bit, and then I would take granola and mix it into the rest of the mix, uh -huh. and then pour it in there so that it maybe mixes throughout. The worst that happens is it settles in the middle. Yeah, yeah. The best that happens is you get granola everywhere. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is great. Okay, I'm glad we figured it out. That last little trick of like the spinning it till it pops, that's the secret. Uh -huh. I don't think that's what would happen with the other one. I do think that that was no, a. No, the other one failure because of the, the way the, um, just the mixture the was. Yeah, so be careful with the recipe. Go to their site and use their recipes first so that you get the full successful experience first. Yeah, it does say that there are, we had trouble showing on it after we couldn't get it to work the first time. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot, there's artificial sweeteners don't work as well. Right. Um, and then the hardest ones to do are the ice cream ones. Yes. So we had started with something that probably had artificial sweetener and was like, yeah, yeah. yeah. yes. So anyways. This is awesome. Okay, so that's three for three. We've had three, zo four. Well, yeah. Technically four. There's a whole playlist full of the other ones that we've tried, so go check out the other Zoku products. There's links below for you to go and check them out online too, and mm -hmm. I, highly, I recommend all of the products we've had. Mm -hmm. I love the ice cream maker. I still make ice cream with it. Uh -huh. It's very, very fun for me. I keep all my Zokus in the freezer. Thank you again so much, Zoku, for sending us these products to try out. Check them out. And uh, Links below. Links below. Mm -hmm. I'm Tara. I'm Natalie. And this was Natalie and Tara Try Stuff. Don't forget to hit the bell because we go live once a week but you won't know unless you hit the bell because that's how you find out. Cheers. Huzzah, it worked. Huzzah.